here? The Hall of the Final Summoning. Go. Yes. Just an empty statue. That statue lost its powers of faith long ago. It is Lord Zeon, the first faith of the final summoning. What you see before you is all that remains of him. Lord Zeon is. his soul is gone. Gone? You mean. There is no final Aeon? But fear not. Lady Unaleska will show you the path. The final Aeon will be yours. The Summoner and the final Aeon will join powers. Go to her now. Inside, the Lady awaits. Yuna, wait! Aaron, you knew this was going to happen, didn't you? Yes. Why didn't you tell us? If I had told you the truth, would that really have stopped you from coming? Yuna. I'm not going back. Kimari knows. Kimari goes first. Yuna is safe. Kimari protect. <gasps> Someone's coming. Lady Unaleska. Welcome to Zanarkand. I congratulate you, Summoner. You have completed your pilgrimage. I will now bestow you with that which you seek. The final summoning will be yours. Now, choose. You must choose the one whom I will change to become the faith of the final summoning. <sighs> there must be a bond between Chosen and Summoner, for that is what the final summoning embodies. The bond between husband and wife, mother and child, or between friends. If that bond is strong enough, its light will conquer sin. A thousand years ago, I chose my husband Zeon as my faith. Our bond was true, and I obtained the final Aeon. There is nothing to fear. You will soon be freed of worry and pain. For once you call forth the final Aeon, your life will end. Death is the ultimate and final liberation. Your father, Braska, chose this path. Let us turn back. If I turn back, who will defeat Sin? Would you have some other summoner and his guardians go through this? But... My lord, there must be another way. 
This is the only way we got now. Fine. Make me the faith. I've been doing some thinking. My dream is back in the other Xanarkand. I wanted to make that runt into a star blitz player. Show him the view from the top, you know. But now I know there's no way home for me. I'm never gonna see him again. My dream's never gonna come true. So make me the faith. I'll fight sin with you, Braska. Then maybe my life will have meaning, you know? Don't do this, Jekt. If you live, there may be another way. We'll think of something, I know. Believe me, I thought this through. Besides, I ain't getting any younger, so I might as well make myself useful. Checked? What? You're not gonna try to stop me, too. Sorry. I mean... Thank you. Braska still has to fight sin, Oren. Guard him well. Make sure he gets there. Uh... Well, let's go. Lord Braska, checked. What do you want now? Sin always comes back. It comes back after the calm, every time. The cycle will continue and your deaths will mean nothing. But there's always a chance it won't come back this time. It's worth trying. I understand what you're saying, Oren. I'll find a way to break the cycle. You... have a plan? Checked? Trust me, I'll think of something. <laughs> Break it. But how? What, you got a plan now? If one of us has to become a faith, I volunteer. Me too, Yuna. That still won't change anything, you know? You'd bring the calm, and then what? That won't break the cycle. Listen, you want to defeat Sin and keep Yuna alive. You don't want Sin to come back, yeah? That is just not gonna happen, brother, you know? If you want everything, you'll end up with nothing. But I want everything! Now you're being childish. I give up. So what would an adult do then? They know they can just throw away a summoner. Then they can do whatever they like. You're right. I might not even have a chance. But no way am I gonna just stand here and let Yuna go. And what Oren said about there being a way, I think it's true. You'll think of... something? Yes. I'll go ask Unaleska. She's got to know something. You really think she'll help you? I don't know. But I have to try. This is my story. It'll go the way I want it. Or I'll end it here. Wait. You say it's your story, but it's my story too, you know? It would be so easy to let my fate just carry me away, following the same path my whole life through. But I know... I can't. What I do... I do... with no regrets.
Have you chosen the one to become your faith? Who will it be? Might I ask something first? Will Sin come back even should I use the final summoning to defeat it? Sin is eternal. Every Aeon that defeats it becomes Sin in its place. And thus is Sin reborn. So that's why Jack became Sin. Sin is an inevitable part of Spira's destiny. It is never ending. Never ending? But, but, if we atone for our crimes, sin will stop coming back, yeah? Someday it'll be gone, yeah? Will humanity ever attain such purity? <sighs> this, this cannot be! The teachings state that we can exercise sin with complete atonement! It's been our only hope all these years! Hope is comforting. It allows us to accept fate, however tragic it might be. No! no! Where is the sense in all this? Braska believed in Yevon's teachings and died for them. Jack believed in Braska and gave his life for him. They chose to die because they had hope. Yevon's teachings and the final summoning give the people of Spira hope. Without hope, they would drown in their sorrow. Now choose. Who will be your faith? Who will be the one to renew Spira's hope? No one. I would have gladly died. I live for the people of Spira, and would have gladly died for them, but no more. The final summoning is a false tradition that should be thrown away. No. It is our only hope. Your father sacrificed himself to give that hope to the people, so they would forget sorrow. Wrong. My father... My father wanted... To make Spiro's sorrow go away, not just covered up with lies. Sorrow cannot be abolished. It is meaningless to try. My father, I loved him. So I... I will live with my sorrow. I will live my own life. I will defeat sorrow in his place. I will stand my ground and be strong. I don't know when it will be, but someday... I will do it without